Yeah, I guess we should do the uh, our new outro where everyone talks at once. Yeah, I hope this is a staple because like having done it in the past has been funny. So I <laughs> yeah. Awesome. Okay, let's all do our all. Let's do our all outro at count of three. Ready? Three, three two, two, one. one. <laughs> I don't have any issue with uh, <laughs> anybody who ever 
what type of music they listen to, what clothes they wear, etc. I know that's no, not that's really perfect. impressive that's moral, perfect. but it's unfortunately right, rare. No. A great many people, this especially is, this those is, my age, uh, 4K uh, gypsy are right judgmental now. about these people. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I love everyone, I can't even people I hate. No. I wish my worst enemy was good force and happiness. Rick Perry is a vile <laughs> piece of shit human being <laughs> deserving of zero respect. But I wish him for consider your better and live the best life possible. I wish just for everyone. I pretty much have passed this. I've taken a broken nose without fighting back for Seeking oh, retribution because the guy be stopped punching after that. The only time I fight back is uh, one, <laughs> the person attacking me shows no signs of stopping, and two, if I don't attack, I'll come out worse than the other person will if I do. In other words, if people fight, if fighting someone is going to end up being more harmful, harmful to them, then just letting me go to uh, will be what the fuck. I won't fight back. Uh, therefore, never had a reason to fight against anyone or anything uh, serious, because it, my ability to take pain has uh, so far made it so that I'm never in a situation where I'll, I'll be uh, worse off after a fight. If I'm not going to get any hospitalization injuries, I really don't care. The only exception is if someone is going after my life. Even then, I'll do the minimum amount of harm to them that I possibly can in protecting myself. If someone points a gun at me and I can get out of it without harming them, I'd prefer to do it that over killing them. I consider myself a feminist. I don't believe in enforcing our uniform gender roles. Uh, they may happen naturally, but they should never be considering in, uh, happening unnaturally, as in the societal, societal uh, pressure for gender roles should really go, even if it'll turn out that the majority of relationships continue operating the same way in their own accord. I treat women with the same outlook I treat men and never participate in the old Reddit. Women are crazy, a circle jerk. Because there are multiple women out there and have different personalities, just like there are uh, multiple men out there and each with different personalities. I don't think you can do much of anything except scare off the awesome women out there uh, by going on and on about the ones who aren't awesome. That doesn't mean that I look for places to victimize women. I just don't believe it's fair to make generalizations such as the ones about women acting like everything's okay when it's really not. And that's a, that's a particularly harsh example because all humans do that. I'm kind of tired of citing these examples. I'm guessing you're really tired of reading them. If you're even made it this far, made if you're even made it this far, in closing, the people who know me in real life I all respect me, as do a great many of people in Reddit Brony community, where I spend most of my time and that where I'm pretty known for being helpful around the community. A lot of people in the segment of the community are depressed or going through hard times. And I spend a lot of time giving my advice and support to people there. Yesterday, someone quoted a case of me doing this in a post asking question that what their favorite motivational slash inspirational quote was, and that comment was the second to the top. So I guess the other people agreed, though granted, it was a pretty low tra traffic post and only about a dozen competing confidence, uh, comments. And uh, I'm a pretty good moderator, all that, and I think your behavior in this thread was totally assholeish. So what do you think? Now uh, that you at least slightly know me, That was the end. That was that was the end. The coffee pastor. Goodbye.